So here's a quick video to show you how to find a unit that you may be managing um, for a separate owner or maybe um, an account that you had before uh, is no longer linked. So if you go here to inspections, um, and there are a couple other places you could do this um, in inspections and uh, clients and units, for example. Um, if you go to inspections, even if you have other inspections that are listed here, you're going to see a feature at the bottom that says, don't see your inspection. Um, you can only see inspections for units that are owned by you or managed by you. So if you go in here, you can click on, I don't see my inspection. And then here, just search for the address of the unit that you are expecting to see in this dashboard. Um, so I'll put 3830 Midvale Circle and then click search. Okay, so now it's telling me this unit's assisted by the Test Housing Authority and we need to verify your information provided to Test Housing Authority. So this may be um, a different housing authority like uh, Anchorage or something like that. But um, what you wanna do next is click on verify. So do you have a relationship code that the Test Housing Authority sent to you? So this is generally a six digit code that we've already sent to you in the past um, when you set up your bot.ai account. If you have a code, um, you can enter that relationship code here um, and type it here and click yes. If you don't have a relationship code, you simply click no here and then verify the email address that the test housing authority is using for this legal entity. So whether you have a separate portal that you're working with them with or um, a previous email address of a coworker that may no longer be with you. You can just enter that full email address here. So we uh, hid parts of the email address and then if you could put in the rest of it, so I'll say zero zero one. So if I click on here, I'll click submit. Now, if you don't have access to this email, you can click here. Okay, and that's it. So now this email has been successfully sent. So here you may not have access to this email address anymore. Um, so you can click here and it's going to ask for you to fill in the last four digits of the tax ID for this address. Um, so this is usually the um, employer identification number or EIN or tax identification number or federal EIN, however y'all call that. Um, so for here, I'll just put the last four and I'll click submit. So now when I go to the inspection dashboard, I'll see all 211 that were associated with that account. Um, so here it tells me all the different items I could see. And all the different chats I'll have visibility for every new inspection that's scheduled, I will see that as well. So now if you have any other inspections that you may not be able to see, you just continue that process again, click on I don't see my inspection, search for the unit, and continue that. Thanks.